Hi, this is my first video showing the work I have done making batteries or capacitors using graphene. Today, I'm going to be using a laser-induced graphene cathode, an aluminum anode, and a polymer electrolyte. First, the anode. I'm using an aluminum foil that I scrubbed with steel wool and a very light solution of copper sulfate hydroxide to increase the surface area. One of the many things I learned from watching Robert Murray Smith's channel on YouTube. This is a laser inscribed graphene cathode that was made using a polyamide film and a 40 watt CO2 laser engraver which I turned down to around 3.8 watts. The polymer electrolyte I am using for this capacitor is made with polyvinyl alcohol and phosphoric acid which was left to dry for around 48 hours. This polymer electrolyte was made using polyvinyl alcohol with a mixture of choline chloride and urea. This took about 72 hours to fully dry. A problem that I encountered working with type 3 or type 4 deep eutectic solvents as an electrolyte was that it's eating away the aluminum anode as seen on the left. On the right is a polyvinyl alcohol and phosphoric acid electrolyte which does not affect the aluminum. I'm still experimenting with different concentrations. Last is the aluminum foil electrode and the laser induced graphene electrode with captain tape on the back. Before assembling, I'm going to paint on some of the polyvinyl phosphoric acid electrolyte so the dried polymer will make good contact with the electrodes. And finally, putting the pieces together. The next video will focus on testing the performance. 